my wife uh, got taken with Alzheimer's and uh, was taken into care. And uh, <laughs> that's something that just reminds me of days gone by. We watched natives carving them and I think, if I remember rightly, this was done in a place called Nisna, which is on the garden route from between Cape Town and Port Elizabeth. This cork is from my wedding day, when we were drinking champagne with my family. My family, being French, kept on calling my husband Kevin instead of Kevin. And we decided that he, they should pay a fine, sixpence a time. So everybody was putting sixpence in his top pocket of his jacket. And in the evening, we had a real tidy sum in sixpences, and we put one in a cork as a souvenir. He loved his football. He played football in school, straight from school. He played for one team on Saturdays. He played for another team on Sundays. He played for a pub team. And he actually got to semi-professional level, but I'm talking about a long time ago, so I think they sort of got something like 10 shillings, you know, for a game. So it wasn't huge money or anything like that, but he was definitely semi-professional level. So he was really proud of his achievements in football. In his railway days, he was captain of the All England team against France for the railways. So he captained the British Rail team for England. It was at that time that I realised that this was a very lovely girl and gradually we became acquainted and we just carried on our love life from there and it was very nice, lovely. Almost magnificent, I suppose you could say. Although she's in such a, a state now, she doesn't really know me anymore, which is rather sad. And then eventually these wonderful memory cafes were set up. And I love doing it because I like being hands-on with people. And when you've had experience with somebody close to you who's had dementia, you do understand you know, what the carers are going through in particular, because they have a really tough time. The people with dementia on the whole, you know, it's a very unpleasant thing to have, but often they can be quite serene 